What's going on you guys? This is MXKDI here. Another Dell Optiplex 3010. This is the desktop and a processor upgrade. I'll show you guys how to do that. So you're going to move the side cover panel. And you need a Phillips screwdriver. Let me try to zoom in. So what you're going to need is uh, you're going to unscrew. There will be four, two screws in the bottom, two in the top. I'm gonna screw that the heat sink. And disconnect the four pin for the fan processor fan here, cooling right here. There's a four pin. It's right here. And what we have to do is we're going to put this little paper here, clean paper, we're going to wipe off the terminal compound here. And the way to do that is you need a credit card. If you have like a spare credit card, you could just use, wipe it off the terminal, old terminal compound here. Just uh, like this, really easy. Comes right off. If your terminal compound doesn't come off really well, just use a 50 to uh, or 70% of rubbing alcohol with the paper towel. Should be perfectly fine to remove it. Remove the old terminal compound. And just use a paper towel. That's perfectly fine, looks all clean like new. But if your doesn't come off really well, just use uh, like 50 to 70% rubbing alcohol, use a paper towel, take it off, should come right off really easy. Mine comes off really easy, it's, it's, uh, it's thermal compound, it's not too uh, dry, but it's all clean. Now, so I'm gonna be upgrading the processor. And you see the edges right here in the top, those ones right here, the edges, that, that goes like that, right? That's going to be the top, the edges right here in the left and right, it'll be edges. See if the camera can zoom in. That will be, that's how you install the processor. We're going to remove the old, the, this old processor here. I'm going to zoom in the camera, you guys can see better. Move this paper here. And the way you install is really easy. Just uh, you see the edges right here, the top edges right here in the top, right here, left and right. That's how you're gonna install it. It'll be the top. Just like that, really easy. Now, I will apply the thermal compound and you can still use uh, some get the thermal compound here. Okay, so let me you can put thermal compound either on the processor right here in the middle or I'm just going to use it on the on the heat sink in the middle. It'll be a lot easier that way. Show you guys do that quickly. So here's a heat sink that's going to put thermal compound right in the middle. Not too much. Through my compound. Okay, now let me. I'm gonna spread it. You can use a credit card just to spread it around in the middle. Not 
That looks perfectly. You can use a credit card to the to to spread uh, thermal compound, but this is like a thin. This is like a clear credit card I cut out. But uh, you could use the credit card. Uh, this is perfectly fine to spread it. Remove that. And when you apply the uh, the heat sink, it will eventually will be evenly in the processor. So now reconnect that four pin for the for the fan connector. Now we're gonna go ahead and uh, connect the heat sink back and we connect the install it back. Zoom out the camera so you guys can see better. Now, okay, we connect, reconnect that. So we put the heatsink back, and we're gonna re put the side cover panel. That's about it, guys. Put the side cover panel. So you guys, at the end of the video, this is a Dell Optiplex 3010, the desktop processor upgrade. Thanks for watching. Bye.